Hi, I'm Grandpa Gary, and I just got here. And today we're gonna do the redemption flight of the Twin Timber. And I got out here right at sunset, so we barely got enough light to go. And I gotta be careful because these guys are out here flying their paramotors because we got no wind. And uh, so let's get this thing in the air and see how it does. All right, those guys have landed now. So let's get the turbo timber in, or twin timber up in the air before it's too dark. Thought will cut off. I do have my IX20 SE back from Horizon Hobby Repair Shop. They didn't find anything wrong, but now it's working good. So I'll take it. I am in high rates and uh, safe is off i did set it up with safe um i do have one click on the flaps let's get this thing going nice and gentle flaps off let's just make some nice easy circles Sounds good. Nice roll. Everything seems to be working good. Hopefully you guys can see those nav lights. It's a little bit dark and they're lighting up pretty good. And uh, one good thing is, is because I've had my vision corrected, I can see it pretty good. So I am happy about that because there was times in the past when I still had the cataracts, uh, this would be too dark. It's kind of doing the knife edge thing. It's kind of tough to do with uh, twin motors. You can see the... The way the motors spool up when you use that rudder, it really makes it pull over. Uh, when you do this, you do that, it really cranks over the top. That's pretty cool. We're not going to set upside down. I'm a little nervous to do inverted, especially with it being just a little bit dark out. But it is flying so good. I'm so happy. All right, I hear full scale up there. Had to make sure there wasn't another guy flying paramotor because they were flying down here nice and low. And uh, so I'm wanting to touch down. Let's take it around this time and we'll throw the flaps on. So I got the timer set to five minutes and it just told me I got three minutes left but I still want to get a good touchdown. Oh. I, I probably tried to correct that the wrong way. All right. There's no wind, so I can take off this direction. Just check in on the full scale. Okay, we don't want it to hit me. There we go. Flaps are off. Here we go. We'll bring it around inverted. As long as I don't cut that throttle, I'm okay. But it is, it is climbing just a little bit inverted, so... Nice tight loops. It is a very, very comfortable flying airplane. Much like all the timbers, very happy with it. Timer 
I'm sure with a little bit of wind, this thing can almost stop. But it is very, the air is dead right now, so not gonna complain. We're just gonna bring this in for a nice landing again, hopefully. Uh, I don't, <laughs> so I don't know how I'm doing that or why, but. Try it one more time. This time we'll land with just one click on the flaps. <laughs> I don't know. We'll try it one more time. I want to get a nice smooth landing and not tilt over. Let's take it on straight up and then use that differential thrust to pull it over. I'm a little bit high for that landing, so let's take it on around. I'll take that one. I still curled around, but at least I didn't drag it, the wing. And I just need to get a little more practice, it looks like. But this thing is nice. And I'm so happy with the way the repairs turned out. And uh, we got our redemption flight. We did fly inverted a little bit. I'm not scared, guys. <laughs> Having a twin timber. Man, I, I didn't think that was something that they would do, but I'm happy they did. And uh, these Navigolites on here looking so good. I'm so happy. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. This thing is so cool. Big thanks to the Lord for a beautiful evening. No wind. The temperature has got to be 65. It just feels great out here. And the Twin Timber did great. The repair turned out okay. Uh, it flies great. So, can't say much more. I appreciate all your guys' support. It'll be linked in the description box. Until next time, I'm Grandpa Gary, and I just got here.